Good morning guys. It is almost 6 a.m. right now. Sorry, I always sound really like tired or sleepy in the morning, obviously. Um, it's about 6 a.m. We are on our way to the Long Beach Flea Market. Last month we went and we went super early like this, well even earlier than this, and it was so nice. We felt a lot safer. There was a lot less people. Everyone was social distancing, so and we got first pick. Good morning. <laughs> we're, we're not awake yet um, and we got first pick of everything and it benefits going really early in the morning so we are on our way it should take us around like 40 minutes to get there so you guys can shop with us we'll see you guys there <laughs> Production. Yeah, no, for sure. The back of it. Oh, wow. So this guy, cool. um, he was a retired physician, and this is part of his collection. Oh, wow. That's so cool. Yeah. What is that? It's an egg skin. Oh, it's an egg. Oh. He, that same collector. It's all same guy. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> 
morning, Marty. selling this wallpaper for? Uh, $5. It's really cool. I'll take it from you. There you go. Thank, Thank you, so you so much. Oh, yeah. Oh, wow. Three. Would you do both for ten? No. Um. Oh, I just, yeah. you know, you don't really see things like that. And I like the look. Yeah. Sometimes I'm like, I used to paint stuff, and I go, no, I just leave it, leave it alone. Yeah. It's always a spot so for a mirror. It'll only work. Plug it into a phone line. Oh, I'll give you twenty bucks for it. Why not? I feel like it's something that if I pass it up, you'll be. You, then you think about it, and I'll loop around, and I'll be like, yeah, I Plus want it, really and I'll come old. back. Look at this. Yeah. They would go around. Oh, do you want to buy a big dresser like this? Then, then they'd order them for the Oh, places. so they're like the sample. Yeah, isn't that cute? That's but so even for like a little kid's room. Totally. Or, or you know, be so cute. I was little and I've only seen a salesman thing like once. Once I had one thing. Oh, thank you very much. No, I don't 
and this is the season for corduroy, even though it's still warm. I know. I think it's more of a wishful dressing than a practical dressing. Yeah. Did you take 40 for him? It says 45. Yeah, sure. Mm -hmm. He's so pretty. <laughs> Five each piece. They're heavy. Yeah. Solid. Are they solid? Solid glass. They're beautiful. How much for this little towel holder? That one is seven dollars. Would you give me two knobs in this for fifteen? Two dollars off? That's not much. I don't haggle much. <laughs> yeah? Okay. Okay. I know. It's a tube. It's a Yeah, I have three of them at home. Yeah, these are the little tiny nicks and stuff, so they're cheaper than usual and 12 now. Oh, no, I only gave you a 10. But I'll take the $2. 
Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, you're so honest. Here, Thank grab, a, so grab a, another bottle. It's you okay. No, no, you're fine. You know, I strongly believe that if you're good to people, people are good to you. <laughs> Thank you. Somebody had something similar to this. Thirty-five each. Feel free to make an offer on them. Would you take fifty for both? Um, I'll do sixty. Thank you for your offer. <laughs> They sell the spray. They sell the spray. Oh, it's gonna Perfect. look so nice on there. Oh, <laughs> say hi. My name is Amber. This is Amber. <laughs> <laughs> I'm probably sweating like crazy. It's hot. You... It's Alessandra. <laughs> look at you. Can show me. Okay, that's before, right? Yes, this is the before. Mm -hmm. And then this is the after. I'm You're... still trying to find a knob for the middle. It's the same knob. But I'm trying to find like a screw that fits. Oh, I see. Yeah. Oh my god, you did amazing. But I loved it. And your channel helped me out so much oh. to be creative, get out of that funk that you're in all the time. I it love makes me it. so happy. Actually, a pretty good flea market trip. These pots I am so excited for. Super heavy. They're like a matte stone white color. A little bit on the creamy side too. So I wanna put these on each side of my front door and then put some really pretty plants, matching plants or something and just kind of like fix that up a little bit. And then I definitely was on the hunt for more gold frames cause I'm doing a somewhat of a um, vintage looking gallery wall. I love when they're like super like gold and ornate like this, so pretty. I got this super textured ornate wallpaper. Can you see all of the texture in that? Look how pretty. A whole roll for five dollars. I knew I had more stuff. Oh my gosh. I was starting to get pretty sad because I was like, wait, I totally thought I had more fun stuff than that. Okay, so from that lady, um, I also got syrup of fig. Oh, syrup of figs. Really looking for like some like little antique kind of bottles like this California Fig Syrup Company. But this one was $2. I was specifically on a mission to find some amber colored glassware, some amber colored bottles, something along those lines. These are actually old Clorox and Lysol bottles. You can see that it says Clorox on the top there. And then this one says Lysol. I don't know why, Lys that's a really small thing of Lysol. Where I'm putting like doors on something and I needed some knobs and I really wanted some vintage style handles or knobs. And I looked around and I couldn't really find any until I came across these solid brass, these are so heavy. These are solid brass doorknobs, pulls, any kind of doorknobs, pull, drawer pulls were perfect for my project. So I was like, I have to, they're here, I gotta get them. From him, I also got this really pretty brass towel holder for like a bathroom. They always have the specific vendors that have lots of beads and lots of the mud cloths and baskets. I have a strand here that I love that I, pay, I think I paid like $15 for that one. And I always, when I wanna style something, I always move it around my house to take pictures. So I'm like, why don't I just get another one? So I got this style, which is super pretty too. I saw so many interior designers or stylists at those booths getting these for the exact reason I want them for, just for like bookshelves, for like something decorative. This, okay, so I paid up for this because I've never seen a long neck face that looks like a little pretty landscape. I kind of fell in love with it and there were some other people in the booth and I was like, no, that has to be mine. And so she had it marked at 45 um, and I offered her 40. I've never been a person to like haggle at flea markets or stuff. It, it really makes me uncomfortable. I don't know why. My mentality is that I look at something and I look at what the person is charging for it and I figure out if it's worth it to me, period. There's no like, I feel bad trying to haggle down something that I would have paid double for. I just, I couldn't walk away from some a situation like that feeling good about myself, so I just don't. I feel like that has gotten me this far and I really just, I just look at something and I'm like, okay, is this worth $40 to me? And it is, and then I'll offer it. This may be not worth $40 to you or it may be worth a lot more, who knows? Like, who is sh Shoemaker? I feel like I've heard that name. This is a little candle holder you can see on the inside. And it was so 
pretty. I loved it so much. I love the colors. Obviously, they're really neutral. This is so pretty. Francoma picture. Oh, because it's the name on the on the bottom, Francoma. I was in her booth, admired. She was talking to another lady, and I was just admiring the cre like curation of her booth. And I turned around, and she was like, "Oh, I know who you are." So I love meeting you guys at any flea market or thrift store it's so much fun to like just meet you guys in real life and so sh this was from her booth i had to get something this was so pretty so these two bottles i have two of them they're a little bit different these are vintage cider beer bottles what they used to come in i wonder how they closed them maybe a cork or something but i actually have three of these already and i would have loved to have more this bowl is i don't think that it's i'm not sure silver plate Leonard Silver Plate Hong Kong for like ten dollars. I feel like it was really pretty for fruit. And the last thing that we got was this horizontal mirror. I felt like this was the type of piece that if I didn't get it, I would find I would find a place that's perfect for something like this and not have it. I paid like twenty bucks for. It. Totally worth it. And Kinsley wants to play now. Oh my goodness. Oh, oh. One of the next vlogs that you'll see is we're gonna work on the porch. Just wanna spruce it up. But I hope you guys did like this video. Give it a thumbs up if you did. It definitely helps the vlog so, so much. And if you're not already subscribed to the vlog or you haven't checked out my latest DIY videos or room makeover videos over on my main DIY channel, Exo McKenna, I will leave it linked for you so that you guys can check it out. We will see you guys next week and on Sunday for a new DIY video. Right, Kingsley? Bye, 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 bye. Where's your baby?